This remote is ridiculously small, and that's why it's always getting lost. Hey everybody, I'm Zach from Smart Geek Home, and today I'm gonna to show you how to reset your Fire Stick using your smartphone instead of your remote. On your smartphone, open up either the App Store for iPhone users or the Play Store for Android users. We're gonna search for Fire TV and look for the Amazon Fire TV app. Go ahead and open that up, download it. At, it's a free app, you won't need to purchase anything. And once that is open, it's gonna ask for some permissions, it's gonna need Bluetooth access, it's gonna need local network. Go ahead and approve these. Um, you don't need to turn on notifications, but uh, you'll need to approve everything else. Since I've used the app before, I've already got a Fire TV device set up here. If this is your first time using the app, go to Set Up New Device, and then select Fire TV, and it should quickly find your device. If it doesn't, it will walk you through some troubleshooting steps. Go ahead and select the Fire TV device you just set up. Turn on your Fire Stick either manually or using your new Fire TV remote app. Now we're going to use the app to open up the settings menu. That's the gear icon in the upper left of the app. And then click on settings in the pop-up. From here, scroll down to My Fire TV. Now hit the middle button on the Fire Stick remote to open My Fire TV. Scroll down until you get to reset to factory defaults. Again, hit the middle button. Now when you hit reset, it's going to start the factory reset process of your device. I'm not going to do that here because I don't want to reset my device. But once you do that, it will take about two minutes and then you're done. Congratulations, you reset your Fire TV to factory defaults and you didn't need your remote. If you found this video helpful, please do leave a thumbs up as it helps other people to find the channel and subscribe so you can get all the latest tips and tricks for your smart home.